Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva, and in today's video, I am going to be touring the Limited. Now, this is a four bedroom, two bath, 1,640 square feet of beautifulness. So let's get right into the video. I'm out at Oakwood Homes in Greenville, South Carolina. These modular homes are absolutely beautiful. I can't wait to show you another modular home at Oakwood Homes. All right, again, this is the Limited. It's out here at Oakwood Homes in Greenville, South Carolina. It is a modular home. It is beautiful. It's four bedroom, two bath. It's I can't wait to show it to you. And it's raining. So let's go <laughs> inside where I can show you this home outside of the rain. Okay. Hey family, just a quick disclaimer. I do not work for the manufacturer or dealer of these homes. I tour these homes because I love touring these homes. If you have any questions about finding this home, pricing or specifications, all the information that I have will be in the description box below. Now let's get back to the video. So this is what you see when you enter the home. I'll spin around so you can see the front door. All right, so this is the front door. You've got all of that space as your entry. So a really nice space to spruce up the way you want. You also have a coat closet here. Um, I guess you could use it for storage or what have you, but you have space up there for the coat closet. All right. So again, this is your foyer area. Really nice space. Love the light color flooring in here. Really pretty. When you come in the front door, the living room greets you. Love those big, pretty windows. All of the space here. It's not completely open, so you have a separation, which is always nice. I love an open home, but not too open where everything is wide open. It gives it more of a, I guess, a stick-built home feel, but also um, it just creates a little more character in the home. So really lovely. You can put your TV here or you can put your TV over there. It's up to you. But you have all of this space as your living room. Really pretty, really, really pretty. Off of the living room here is your kitchen and dining room. Okay, so to the right, you have your dining room. You have actually sliding glass doors that could lead out to your deck. So that's nice. Really lovely. All of this space. This is a fairly small table. It would be enough for me and my husband, but you could absolutely extend this a table, have a much bigger table. You can even put a table over here that has a leaf in it because this is a nice wide area for your dining room, okay? Then your kitchen is on this side. You have an island here. Love that they have the darker, they have light flooring. You have darker cabinets, and then you have a, a light uh, counter space and island space that's similar to the flooring. It look, it really is a nice contrast, and it's very beautiful. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Really nice. Nice big side-by-side -side refrigerator and all the cabinet space you need. Really nice. Ceramic top, uh, stove with your Whirlpool, uh, Whirlpool appliances, ceramic top stove, okay? And a built-in microwave, really nice. Give you a look at what your island looks like. Love the fact that you have those big uh, pot drawers over there. They're becoming standard in a lot of homes now. And that's really awesome because a lot of times when you put pots in these type cabinets especially when they don't have shelving like this one does it makes it hard to keep it organized so i really appreciate the fact that they have all of these pot drawers and you have some additional pot drawers right there so really pretty really pretty now
you've got pantry space here. Okay. And now, wow, this right here to me is all the pantry space I need. And I would be so happy with this pantry space. This, this is a house that keeps giving because you have pantry space next to the refrigerator. But then look over here off the dining room. You have even more. Like, what you gonna be storing in here? <laughs> I'm saying, you got all of that pantry space over there. And then you got, a, this room is big enough for a twin bed. Look at there. All of this is pantry. And this door actually closes so people don't have to see that you're a hoarder or that you just got a lot of stuff. However, y'all know I love appliances, so this would actually store my appliances as well. So, it's a good look. Way to go, Oakwood Homes. I love it. On this side of the dining room, is your laundry room. So, through here, your washer and dryer goes there. And then here, I guess you have your back door coat closet. So much storage. These homes out here at Oakwood Homes have so much storage. Now I can't open this door. This is the back door. And they have protectors here so you don't get hurt. But you do have your back door here in the laundry room. You also have a window that opens in here, which is always nice. So really, really well put together laundry room as well. Love it. So you got a back door and you've got a sliding glass door in this home. Really nice. Back into the kitchen. Pantry. Bigger pantry. Laundry room. All of this could be yours in this home. Now that's the master. We'll see the master last. Let's go down on this side of the house and see the additional bedrooms. So, right down this hall, you have bedroom number one. Okay. Really nice size bedroom. All of this is bedroom number one. And then you've got this really nice walk-in closet here. So that's your walk-in closet for this room. Okay, bedroom number one. Next to bedroom number one, you've got bedroom number two. I always like to kind of circle the room, give you another angle, and you've got another walk-in closet. Okay, so that's bedroom number two. Next to bedroom number two, you've got your linen closet. So much space in here. So that's your linen closet next to bedroom number two. And then next to bedroom number two, you've got your second bathroom. Look at all the storage space you have. Love that it had, this extra storage space has shelves in it. And it's soft clothes. Yes, we're gonna stand here and watch it close. Y'all know I love my soft clothes. <laughs> Love it. Bam. Love it. <laughs> Love my soft clothes. All right. That's your second bathroom. And then bedroom number three. So again, this is a four bedroom, two bath. So this is your 
third additional bedroom. Okay, this one has a standard closet, but it has a nice size closet. Okay. And this is bedroom number three. So again, when you come down the hall from the living room, okay, when you come down this hall, you have bedroom, bedroom, linen closet, bathroom, bedroom, and then you can go back to the living room. Okay, really good. So on the other side of the living room, closest to the kitchen, you have the master. Whoa, what a big master. Really nice. I would for sure put a ceiling fan in here. This is a big master. Really nice. I like that it's cat corner for some reason. All right, this is your master closet. Let's see if the light is working, yep. So you've got your master closet here. All of this is master closet. Let me stand against this wall and show you how far it goes. So this is all master closet. And then your attic is in here in the master. Really nice. I'll go on this side. So pretty. So much space. So you got your master in master bed. You got your master closet in the bedroom. And then your master bath is next to the master closet. So the fan is working, but not the light. So you've got double sinks there. Lots of drawers and cabinets. You got a window that opens and then your toilet. And then you got a tub and shower combo in here. So not the biggest master bath, but it, it has a huge master closet. I could have, see this is a three bedroom, two bath, maybe a single parent. This is all the bathroom I personally would need. And even if my husband and I were here, we have two separate bathrooms. I use the master and he uses the additional. He takes a shower in the master, but his sink space and his counter space and his under cabinet space is in the other bed, bathroom. So I could totally, this would be okay with me. What would matter to me is this space right here. If I was looking and if this was an option for me. So, you know, it doesn't have to be a deal breaker. It's really up to what you need. There's a home for everybody. Really lovely. Now, again, this is the limited. Four bedroom, two bath. 1,640 square feet. Out here at Oakwood Homes in Greenville. Priced at $195,805. Okay? Really nice. All right, if you're interested in any features of the home, remember all the information I have is down in the description box. You can contact the dealer with your questions, okay? Thanks so much for joining the Mobile Home Diva.